Okay guys, what you're looking at is a little Ziploc container and in here I have my blue Jabea Chalensa seeds. These were put in here October 24th uh, and today is January 5th, I believe. So, not that long. Six weeks and 13 or I counted and I think I see 13 of 20 have popped these were fresh seed uh, they came from Josh O down in Carlsbad California and I do have um, a few Jabea Chalensis already I have a couple planted out but they're just the regular green variety um, there are I guess some that have a bluish tinge to them so I know they look green right now but over time they may start to get that um, bluish tinge. So I'm going to probably tra start transplanting some of these up now. You can actually see the leaf coming out. I'm going to keep them inside the house. And uh, probably in April, I'll put them out in the greenhouse and kind of grow them out there. Give them a year or two, and, and then maybe I'll start putting them in the ground. But it will be interesting to see if these actually do develop that bluish uh, tinge. And a lot of people, when they germinate Jubea seeds... They think the trick is to give them heat, um, but not heat all day, just, you know, a few hours of heat on a heating pad and then turn it off. That kind of um, change between hot and cool, hot and cool uh, makes them pop. But uh, these seeds were very fresh and I just put them in here and I wanted to see what happened. Um, and they just, they went on their own. So um, fresh seeds always trump just about everything else. But uh, if you're having problems, that, that's uh, a good way to do it. Some people also suggest kind of cracking them, but uh, I didn't need to. So I would have been happy with three or four um, at 13. And I have a feeling probably most of these will go. So um, we'll see what happens. So I'll do some updates over time. They seem to grow reasonably well. Uh, it's, not the, it's obviously not a fast-growing palm, but uh, I'm in the Pacific Northwest, just outside of Portland, Oregon. And... Uh, they seem to go pretty well here. Um, Jubeas do best on the West Coast. Thanks for watching.